All right, guys, looking a bit like Terry Wogan with like a comb over at the moment. Um, this is take two of the video because I kind of went on a little bit of a rant about the uh, parking situation at the local school, which uh, puts local residents basically out because you can't park because some fucking fat bastard parent who lives two minutes away is picking up their fat bastard children who should do a bit more exercise. The walk home would do them a world of good. And if it's not that, it's people who live like two, three, four postcodes away who have got schools in their local area. But no, we'll infest this area. So you can see why this is take two. And then I went off with about my, uh, you know, local MP, Rosie Cooper, and then Lisa Nandy, and, you know. We'll leave that there. We'll leave that there. Follow me on Facebook or add me as a friend. You can see my political rantings there. But it's not about that. So I got to go home from uh, work early today and it's a lovely day so I don't know if you can see the, the smoke um, so I'm burning some you know like old receipts and you know letters and bank statements and things like that and uh, a lot of evidence which could incriminate me but we won't talk about that and I thought you know what, I'll have a few beers while I'm doing it and uh, I cracked open a can of even from Northern Monk. Now you've probably heard me if you're a regular viewer of the channel uh, all five of you uh, that I absolutely love this beer and uh, yeah crack this open and the first sip I was like I've not had this for a, a good while and I just had a, just that you only have like first sip of a beer that you love but you've not had for ages and it's just like why don't I just have like a continuous stockpile of you in the fridge and let's face it with the coronavirus you know we've got to self um, isolate before that happens, I might just do like a full pallet of this and have it delivered to me. Um, so then I can, you know, be safe and sound, but merry at the same time and not, you know, wanting to blow my own brains out. But, um, yeah, so I, I was drinking this and I'm drinking it now. And it got me thinking, this is, for me, the best core range craft beer you can get. And it got me thinking, I want to hear what you guys think. Like, what's your favourite, like, craft beer, um, like, core range? Or it could be your favourite real ale core range beer that's brewed 365 days a year. Now, specialty brews that come around, like, two or three times a year, they're not counted in that because they're not there for, you know, everyday consumption because you've got to wait for them to be brewed. Whereas a beer like this, they're brewing this all the time because it's a very popular beer for them. And they've got a very popular core range at Northern Monk. And uh, essentially, it doesn't have to be a local brewery. Um, there's no like real stipulations in that regard. All I want to know is, and I'm not like classing stuff like, oh, I'll pick up a four pack of Carlsberg on the way home, or like a four pack of, you know, that doesn't count. Craft beer like this. What is your favorite go-to core range craft beer? doesn't have to be IPA, it can be any sort of beer. Um, if I had it, it would probably be, you know, hard for me to pick between this and Common Grounds from uh, Magic Rock. So, uh, yeah, if you want to do a video response, you do a video response. If you just want to leave a comment, you leave a comment. Or if you don't want to participate at all, that's absolutely fine. If you want to, you know, showcase your local brewery, then do it, or if it's a brewery that's on the other side of the country, or even on the other side of the world, you know, you could even class something like uh, Sierra Nevada's Pale Ale, or, you know, something like that into this. But I just want to hear what your thoughts and opinions are. Um, so yeah, not exclusive to UK viewers and uh, beer drinkers, I just want to know, what is your pound for pound favourite core range UK beer? core range beer. Don't know why I said UK. Um, yeah, it's only my second beer and I'm a little bit tipsy. Probably because I haven't, I, haven't, I haven't had my lunch yet. Ah, oh, so glorious. So yeah, if you want to do a video, feel free to do so. Leave a comment, feel free to do so. Or if you just want to ignore this video, feel free to do so. But I just thought I'd put it out there because I like these sort of things. Um, in the back of my mind, I'm thinking of Swig and Steve with his uh, Tesco four for six pound video, which I really enjoyed watching. And then the subsequent, 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 subs, subsequent. What's the word? Uh, 
<laughs> responses that followed. And uh, people taking their kids from that school must think, who the fuck is stood behind a fence talking to himself? Anyway, I've got more stuff to burn. Um, it's probably died out now, but I'll just have another cigarette and throw the cigarette in there and I'll reignite it. Maybe throw some uh, alcohol in there, but not this one because I'm drinking it. Anyway, yeah, joking aside, I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions on this one, guys. And um, yeah, fair dues. See you guys later. Cheers.